preparations have been going well. Um, it's uh, looking good, but the opposition is very young and very strong, so it'll be tough, it won't be easy. I enjoy coming to Y, I enjoy the sport, and if I didn't race, I'd be, I'd be very fat and overweight, so at least this gives you some sort of direction and some goal, and, and because it's fun and because I've had a good balance, I think that's why I'm doing it for such a long time. It seems to be a slight bit of uh, wind, not very much, so it's going to be tough, it'll be hot, you know, because I think we're going to be going the same speed as the wind. And obviously, I need uh, more rougher conditions so that I can actually use my skill in paddling on flat water, but you can't have it all, you know. I'm here, it's a pity. <laughs> Just disappointing as you saw from the start. I mean, where, while the wind was sort of sideways and not ahead, I was very comfortable and I was, and then suddenly I dropped back, which is not normally. Normally I start going through the field and I felt very comfortable and I don't know what it is. I mean, I, I felt like I had caught weed and then suddenly I went backwards. Doing good, Oscar. All these guys are going to come to you. You know the score. Keep it up, Oscar. Do what you do best. I knew that if it's into the wind, I mean, I haven't done any training to go into the wind. I've, all I've done is really concentrated on doing downwind three, three and a half hours. I mean, again, as I told people, I mean, I'm doing this for fun. And paddling, slogging there for four, four and a half hours is not fun. Doing it for three and a half hours is a lot of fun where I can sit down and catch waves and you know, that's fun. You know, and the first little part you might have seen I was getting waves and yeah. things like that. So that was fun. And at 50 you want to do it for fun. I mean I still enjoy it and I still want to win it in my 50s and, and, and get it number 13 and uh, it'll be there. I mean just got to get the conditions right and I'm sure I can, I can get there. Clint uh, did a fantastic job, I mean, he paddled well, I mean, and he was fit and he must have done a lot of uh, flat water paddling and, and hard, long slogs, which paid off. I think I nailed it pretty well, you know, I, uh, it was a flat, hard race today, there was not much assistance, so you required a lot of paddling, and uh, yeah, it worked out a heck of a lot better this year than uh, I was pretty dirty on myself last year. With my level of experience, that stuff just shouldn't happen to me, so um, anyway, we fixed it a bit, so it was good. I thought Sean Rice would be very good and he would paddle a great race. Um, a couple of the young guys from Australia, Sam Norton and um, Corey Hill, um, and they all finished in top four. So the guys that I thought would be okay were, uh, were the guys that were competitive. Finishing ninth was all right. I mean, I don't. It's not my best, best finish, and I, and I and I was catching up towards the end quite nicely, and then the finish came a bit sooner. And maybe I, I caught a nice big one out there, which, which is fantastic. I like that. I mean, and it's a nice way to finish a race, you know, to catch a big wave and just enjoy it. You know, I spent 30 years doing it, and and, and, uh, and I really enjoy the. It's like a roller coaster ride out there, and coming in through the waves is also a lot of fun. You know, it's skill and skill uh, equals age and I've got a lot of that on my side.